Jack and Jill went up the hill to fetch a pail of water. So they say the subsequent fall was inevitable. They never stood a chance they were written that way. Innocent victims of their story. Like Romeo and Juliet. Twas written in the stars before they even met. That love and fate and the touch of stupidity would rob them of their hopes of living happily. The endings were often a little bit gory. I wonder why they didn't just change their story. We're told we have to do what we're told, but surely. Sometimes you have to be a little bit naughty. Just because you find that life's not fair, it doesn't mean that you just have to grin and bear it. If you always take it on the chin and wear it, nothing will change. Even if you're little, you can do a lot. You mustn't let a little thing like little stop you. If you sit around and let them get on top, you might as well be saying you think that it's okay, and that's not right. Cinderella in the cellar didn't have to do much as far as I could tell. Her godmother was two-thirds fairy. Suddenly her lot was a lot less scary. But what if you haven't got a fairy to fix it? Sometimes you have to make a little bit of mischief. Just because you find that life's not fair, it doesn't mean that you just have to grin and bear it. If you always take it on the chin and wear it, nothing will change. Even if you're little, you could do a lot. You mustn't let a little thing like little stop you. If you sit around and let them get on top, you might as well be saying you think that it's okay and that's not right. And if it's not right, you have to put it right. In the slip of a boat, there's a tiny vault, a seed of a war in the creak of a floorboard. A storm can begin with a flap of a wing. The tiniest mind backs the mightiest in every day. Starts with the tick of a clock. All escapes start with the click of a lock. If you're stuck in your story and want to get out, you don't have to cry, you don't have to shout, cause if you're little, you can do a lot. You mustn't let a little thing like little stop you. If you sit around and let them get on top, you won't change a thing. Just because you find that life's not fair, it doesn't mean that you just have to grin and bear it. If you always take it on the chin and wear it, you might as well be saying you think that it's okay and that's not right. And if it's not right, you have to put it right. But nobody else is going to put it right for me. Nobody but me is going to change my story. Sometimes you have to be a little bit naughty.